<clears throat> I work for Lincoln International, which is the uh, largest global uh, investment bank. Uh, I'm their MD CEO. We uh, advise our clients for uh, M&A uh, or capital raise. We have 20 offices across 15 different countries. And in India, we started in 2011, and we have been present since. IVF industry has really not taken much bigger investments so far. Uh, I believe uh, the reason for that is uh, the industry and the practices. So uh, till the time the practices don't uh, adhere to uh, the standards of quality, they don't adhere to transparency, they don't uh, adhere to ethics, and the governance is not right, I believe uh, most of the businesses will struggle getting money. The businesses who have got money, if we look at uh, within IVF, be it uh, uh, Nova Fertility, be it uh, anybody else, I think they had some standards of uh, quality, quality protocols or uh, ethics or governance. So I think once, uh, and I believe in the conclave downstairs, <coughs> we, uh, I think, articulated this and uh, the doctors realized the importance of all these facts. And once that uh, gets up, I believe uh, money will chase them. So I believe that government should be, uh, government is sitting on the bill. So ART bill should be coming as an act and uh, there has to be a regulation around it. Uh, though people say that needs to be self-regulated, etc. But I believe a regulation will work better in India as opposed to self-regulation. We have seen the West where uh, you have some regulations, even if they are not regulated, people go and publish. Uh, the data, etc., which I think if uh, starts happening in India in a more regulated manner, this will give more comfort to one, the patient, for them to look at what and where they are going, and second, to of course the investors, where their money is going and which practices they are backing. I don't know, I mean, the uh, government has been sitting with the bill for uh, last few years, so unless uh, the bill comes and becomes an act, I think that will be a positive uh, step in that direction to make things change. This is a great initiative, I believe. So but at least it is bringing the doctors together at a forum where they are talking about things, they are getting investors to talk about things, what investors expect from the doctors. So it's a great forum, but uh, I'm not sure whether the what India needs is awareness. So but today, if we look at 27 lakh uh, you know, couples needing, uh, I mean 27 lakh infertile women needing infertility, uh, fertility treatments, and uh, the only way they will come to the IVF clinics is through awareness. So most of them get lost within the gynecologist networks and they just have a bad uh, experience. So unless you get the awareness right, you know, things won't change.